Oh, I can imagine, yes, yes. <laughs> Fine, just look at him, yep. right? Uh, you do the questions, and if I, if I say, oh, could we do that question again, just, just go straight into asking the question again. Okay, all right, no problem. Okay, Brent, what difference can Homestead Senior Care make? Well, I think the main priority is the client or the service user can stay in their own home. They've got the facility to have their friends, family all around them. They haven't got to go somewhere where they don't know, they don't know the environment. So they can stay in their own home, plus all the carers who go in there are fully trained. And we'll the folk... Okay, Graham, uh, what difference can Homestead Senior Care make? Well, I think the main well, the first priority is obviously the client can stay in their own home. They've got the facility to have their friends, family, their own belongings around them. And how our carers are focused on person-centred care, so all the care we provide will be focused on that person for their wants, their needs, when they want them. And could you describe, Greg, what is quality care? Quality care is when the person is happy, they're safe, they're getting the care they want, the care we provide, and basically the client is happy and there's no problems whatsoever with the client. Can we do that again? I think we've got some office notes. Yeah, I do. Great. Could you describe what is quality care? Quality care is when the client is happy, if their client is safe. We might have to ask your staff to. Yeah. Not so much stop banging, so much these voices as well. Okay, we'll try it one more time. Yeah. Great. Could you describe what is quality care? Well, quality care is what Home Instead provides. It's when the client is happy, the client is safe, and all the staff are fully trained to the highest standards. So obviously the, the time we're with the client they're hundred percent safe and the care they provide is going to be quality. And it's getting there on time? Definitely on time, stay in the same period of time and obviously I think quality care involves the same carer. If you can provide the same care all the time then the, the carer knows what to do and the client's happy. Can you tell us about the same carer again? It's important that the same carer goes all the time because the client gets to know the carer and the carer knows the client, the client knows the routine and the, obviously then everyone's happy. Can I throw something in there? Could, when you mentioned about the carer, it's about building that relationship up. Yeah. You know, we should throw yeah. the word relationship in. Right. So if we could, you know. Yeah. So Greg, what is quality care? Quality care is what Home Instead Senior Care provides. It's where the client is safe, the, the carers are fully trained 100% so the client is always happy and safe. And also we always send in, if possible, the same carer all the time. So then there's that repetition, that, that there's trust, there is respect and the client then gets to know the carer, the carer gets to know the client and in a way you become friends and everyone's happy. Why did you choose to become a caregiver? A long time ago I nursed my mother who was quite ill and very recently I nursed my mother-in-law who now has dementia and has gone into a care home. And we sat there again. Yeah. If it's at all possible to, to put some of the questions back into the answer so it's freestanding. So if it says why did you become a caregiver? We say I became a caregiver okay. because okay. Yeah. 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 I'm sorry about this. It, That's all right. When you start listening to it, the traffic seems very loud. It's only when there's a roaring motorbike or something. Oh, so right. We'll get there, we're probably halfway through. Ben, why did you choose to become a caregiver? I chose to become a caregiver because a long time ago I looked after my mother who was quite poorly. And then very recently I looked after my mother-in-law who now has gone into a nursing home with dementia. So and prior to that I worked in an office. And at the end of the day I would get home and think, well, what have I achieved? So I thought, Originally I wanted to become a nurse and I thought no, I want to look after people so that's why I became a caregiver because at the end of the day when someone says thank you, that little smile and you feel as though you've done something for that person, it beats everything else. Yeah, it motivates you. It motivates, definitely. And what difference do you think the training 
makes. Well, obviously, all the training, everything is ongoing. I mean, there's always new techniques and everything else. And with, the, with Home Instead, they're very good at the training stage. <laughs> <Not cute>. <laughs> <laughs> and, Greg, what difference do you think does the training make? Well, obviously, the training makes a, a better carer. Uh, there's always new techniques coming on board, there's new methods of doing things and with Home Instead you're always 100% trained up. All the new techniques are covered and plus it's an ongoing training situation. Mm. You know, yearly you have updated training so you're, you're the carer that can do the best job. So the sort of training that you've received here at uh, Rise Up Office is yeah. Well, it's, it's made me a better person, it's made me very good at my job and made my clients happy because I'm happy. Okay. I'm going to ask you to do the question again, we had a funny motorbike. I'm going to put this mo microphone uh, as close as possible yeah. uh, to make life so you're not fighting the traffic. All right. Uh, I think you're doing really well, but the, the, traffic, the traffic is having a go with us. <laughs> I know. It doesn't matter for most things, does it? Just get that a bit nearer without being in shot. Questions, answers, super. They're okay, Absolutely. <laughs> uh, it's actually, I mean, it's, it's led me into asking you a couple more questions. Yeah. Chanting on the sheet. That's right. Yeah. Which is what we said coming down on the train, didn't we? Yeah. yeah. You know, if you can, it. yeah. It's daunting, isn't it? I know. <laughs> <laughs> <It's a, yeah. laughs> In lots of ways, it's much less threatening having the pearl mics. Yes. It's forgotten about. Yeah, we need to uh, get some of the pearl mics. Oh, them. yeah, yeah, then just put them on, yeah. yeah. <coughs> right, that's as near as I get. It probably is nearer. Right, let's do the last question again. Okay, and then we'll go for it. Yeah. Okay. Ben, what difference does your training make? The training makes, obviously, a better carer you're better at your job and the training is always ongoing because obviously there's new techniques, there's new ways of doing things. With Home Instead, you're always in front. So you always get that training when you need it as soon as it comes available. So at the end of the day, you're a better carer and the client's happier because you're, you're trained 100%. I'm going to do it again. Okay. Just want to write something down. Oh, that's all right then. <laughs> Ask that last question again. Let's go from the top. You go from the top? Yeah, all of them. Okay. Yeah. Are we... There's only quite a few adjustments. Yeah. Is this it though? I'm going. Okay, all right. Morning, Graham. Graham, what difference can Home Instead Senior Care make? Well, obviously to the client, the, f the main thing is they can stay in their own home. They've got the facility to have their own belongings around them, their own friends, their family. Plus as well, a home instead carer is trained to do person-centred care. So all the care will be focused on the client or the service user and you can do what they want, when they want it. And basically they're, they're more independent, they've got an independent life. And what do you think, what would happen if you didn't go? Well, I think they'd miss us. <laughs> obviously, if we weren't about, obviously they'd have to maybe, possibly, go into a care home. And who would want that? I mean, everyone wants their own home. They want their family and friends around them. So we make an important part to people's lives. And could you describe, Greg, what is quality care? Quality care, to me, is when the patient... Uh, not the patient, sorry. The client, the service user... Yeah, 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 yeah. Could you describe what is quality care? Quality care is when the service user is happy, safe, they get what they want when they want it, and 
a, a home instead senior carer is fully trained so, so they can provide what the client wants at the right time. Okay. Can we do that question again? Yes. And mention the word client instead of service. Client, not yeah, service client user. Care. Okay. So, Graham, could you describe what is quality care? Quality care is when a client gets what they want, they feel safe, they, f they trust the carer, they know the carer is going to turn up on time, and the carer is going to do what the client wants. Because obviously, Home Instead Senior Care trains their staff up to 100% to do their job perfect. And Greg, what, why did you choose to become a caregiver? Basically, a long time ago, I looked after my mother, who was poorly, and just recently, my mother-in-law became ill, and now, unfortunately, she had to go into a care home with dementia. And prior to that, I worked in an office environment, and I'd get home at night, and I'd think, what have I achieved? Whereas now, I get home at night and think, I've helped somebody. You know, just that little smile, that little thank you, makes a lot of difference. And talking of difference, what difference do you think the training makes? Well, obviously, it's an ongoing training situation because there's always new techniques, new ways of doing things coming on board. And with Home Instead, they're always 100% there. They'll always update your training and it makes you a better person. Can we pause that? There's a big lorry just coming on to... All right. <laughs> Let's just relax down. I'm going to stop the camera. Do you notice 